Hey guys! Welcome, welcome! Big ass welcome to everyone in chat. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys doing well. Um... Honestly... Ricky's got no idea what he's doing. The, um... The main reason Ricky's streaming today... Is like... Because tomorrow Ricky's not working, so Ricky's got like the day off, so Ricky can sort of stay up a little. So Ricky was like, "Yeah, hey, what better thing to do than to like, you know, just do a stream or something?" But Ricky isn't really sure what Ricky wants to stream. <laughs> but if you guys got any um suggestions, Ricky's open to suggestions. Uh. But yeah, hello to everyone in chat. Hello to Zavo, Viado, Shiki, Phoenix. How you guys doing? Welcome, welcome. Um, Ranky was saying possibly chess, possibly chess. If um, if there's enough people to play with Ranky, Ranky would play chess. But then again, you know, we don't know how the turnout's gonna be for Ranky streams. It's been kind of um. Uh, fluctuating because Ricky can't seem to stream at the like the at the same time every single day so like it's always been different surviving doing well as always how are you doing Ricky <laughs> those are like the opposites <laughs> like Shiki like surviving and then Viado's like oh doing great doing well <laughs> you know me always always fine and dandy <coughs> Excuse Mikey. But yeah, um if you guys wanna know how Mikey's doing, Mikey's having some whiskey right now. <laughs> so if that doesn't uh explain how Mikey's week has been, maybe maybe the whiskey will speak for itself in a bit. I had a lot of meat for lunch today, so my mood can't possibly be brought down. Wait till you like Wait till you like fart though, and like correct Mikey if you're if Mikey's wrong, but like when you eat lots of meat, doesn't that make your fart smell like less appetizing than usual? Eh. But yeah, Ricky was thinking of what Ricky could do. Could be chess. Could be um. Ricky was thinking maybe um Minecraft, because it's been a, it's been a, it's been a bit since Ricky's done Minecraft. If not Minecraft, uh, maybe art or something. Ricky's no idea. Honestly, Ricky's got no idea. We're pretty free form today. Today's stream is pretty free form. Hey Ross, how you doing? Welcome, welcome to Mikey's stream. Hope you, uh, hope you're having a great, uh, Sunday. I don't know, I don't smell my own farts. You don't smell your own farts, Phoenix? Why not? Meat doesn't do that to me, but eggs do. Ah, uh, the egg farts. Yeah, 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 yeah. Egg farts are a thing. But Phoenix, what do you mean you don't smell your own farts? Who doesn't smell their own farts? Like, you fart, and then it's in the immediate area, so you just gotta smell it. Unless you fart and you, like, run away from the fart area. Or you hold your breath for, like, 30 seconds until it dissipates. Ricky doubts you do either one of those, so you definitely smell your own fart, Phoenix. Don't smell them voluntarily. Oh, okay, 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 fine, fine. So you've like fart and then you go like, eh, all right, there it is. <laughs> Should specify, not intentionally. Exactly, exactly. Mercy's told like this story a while back before, but Mercy's um, Mercy's brother. So, so you guys know those like um, chewing gum containers right have you guys seen it they look like vitamin containers you guys know what um you guys know what that is it's like you buy the gum you buy the gum and it comes in like a 
container. Yeah, those? Yeah, so Ricky's brother had like an empty one, right? And then one day Ricky's brother was just like, you know what? Gonna like collect my farts inside of this chewing gum container and see if it actually holds it in. And then, um, and Ricky was like, pretty sure it won't. Because you know how, like, um, it's not, like, airtight, is it? It might be. It might be. But, so, we weren't sure. So, we experimented. And Ricky's brother, um, for the next few days was, like, farting until, like, hope the gum was taken out beforehand. It was empty. It was empty. <laughs> it was empty, Beato. Uh, so, Ricky's brother actually started farting into the, uh, container for the, uh, the next few days. Like, maybe three days or so. Like, every time he needed to fart, he'd be like, oh, he'd, like, run over to, like, the uh, container, uh, crack it open and quickly fart in it and close it again. And then, um, like, after a few days, he was like, you know what? Gonna smell it. And then he opened the container. <laughs> and he gave it a whip and he went to puke. So yeah, those things are pretty airtight, guys. If you want, if you want to keep something fresh, use a chewing gum container. Yeah, but that that was interesting. It was interesting. Ho hopefully that that didn't gross anyone out too much. Ah, <laughs> uh, but that was good. It was good. Hmm. I get myself banned in streamers? What'd you mean, Ross? What'd you mean? What'd you mean? Speaking of gum, Marky's not had gum in a bit. What's like... What's that green gum? Wrigley's? Wrigley's? I just joined in to farting in the gum container. <laughs> hey, Kaiser. That's pretty much it. You haven't missed much. That's pretty much all we've been talking about. Farting into a gum container and like whether you, or not you like smell your own farts intentionally. This is a bad time. It's a great time, Kaiser, honestly. There's no better time. Ricky is trying to decide what to do though. We were thinking maybe chess, maybe Minecraft, maybe uh maybe art, maybe Apex really depends guys ricky's like at a loss mm -hmm. or we could just chat you know if if you guys are up for the uh the chatting my favorite chewing gum as a kid was like a cigarette gum oh you mean one of those nicotine gums viado ricky's favorite was like hubba bubba hubba bubba was really good hubba bubba No, not nicotine gum. So what What you mean by cigarette gum then? Did it taste like cigarettes? Or was it shaped like a cigarette? I just remember, what's the limits for art request redeem? You can request anything, but Mercury will do the uh, quality based on what you request. So if you request like maybe like two characters, it'll, it won't be as great as like if you request like one character or something like that, you know? Ricky will put in the same amount of efforts for all the art redeems. So yeah, just a little heads up for those of you who are eyeing to get the uh, art request redeem. There is a queue though. There is a queue of three people right now. Ricky just hasn't been able to to really do it yet. Hi Evan. Hey Shay, how you doing? Welcome, 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 welcome to Ricky's stream. How you doing, Crochet? It was just normal bubblegum, but it was wrapped in cigarette colored paper and it had powder on it. So if you blew on it, you'd puff out. Sp what the heck is this? Really? Ah, uh, guys, let's ho hold on. Ricky's going to like open up a little um a screen. All right. So that so that Ricky can like um show you guys stuff on browser as we uh as we uh we do just chatting. So, like, um, did you guys eat, like, lots of, like, candy as a kid? Um, Ricky doesn't know how to, like, 
uh, what's it called? Hold up, let Ricky just do this. Ricky will minimize the chat a little, and then Ricky will get the uh, the browser in. Uh, let's see, what browser should we? Uh... Uh, thanks for the alert, Kaiser. It was the coolest thing to me as a kid. They like to do these kinds of gimmicks to make kids buy like like different kinds of candy. Um, for Ricky, Ricky really liked the. Uh, you guys know the one with the head, and then like the. Uh, The one with the head. And then like you you pull the head back and like the candy pops out in the mouth. You guys know that one? Ah, thank you for the follow, Mara Banshee VTuber. Thank you, thank you for the follow. How you doing? Welcome to Ricky's stream. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Pez? Oh, okay, okay. Is that what it's called? Like Pez? Or is it P Z? Is it pronounced or is it is it P Z guys? Let Ricky know. Also, let's see. Um, this one. All right, we're using private because Ricky doesn't want to accidentally dox himself or anything. Also, um, um, if you guys do see anything a little suspicious, just ignore it. <laughs> Hello, Uwu, you're very cute. Ah, uh, thank you so much, Mara. Can Ricky call you Mara? Is it Mara? Let's see, where should we put the... Let's put it here, behind the vines. All right, there we go. There we go. Look at that, guys. We're doing the uh, browser stuff. Ricky's never, like, sort of done that before. Um... There was also that other... That other, um... It's like a popsicle, but you break it in half. What, what's that one called? Popsicle ice thingy break in half. Hold up, hold up. Ricky needs to... This thingy, this thingy. Did you guys eat this thingy as a kid? Did you... Mara's okay. Hello, Ricky. Hey, Wally. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Did you guys eat this as a kid? Hippity hoppity, I'm now lurking and that did not rhyme. No worries about it, uh, killer. Someday you'll find the time. <laughs> Those are yum, cheap, cheap, 30 cents. Exactly, they were really, 30 cents, Ricky paid 50. Ricky paid 50. Anyway, yeah, maybe it's like a Southeast Asian thing. Have you guys seen this? Isn't this ice? It is ice. It's like frozen. No, it's like syrup. And then they freeze it. Now that Ricky thinks about it, we were paying for like sugar water, frozen sugar water. <laughs> what are they called? What are they called? Are they just called popsicles in general? It's like these things, you know? Also, why are we using Bing? <laughs> Never mind, let's just use Bing. But yeah, it is frozen syrup. But yeah, you know how, like, as a kid, like, um, sugar is just good. Sugar. Ricky's never had this one. Ricky sees this one in, like, anime and stuff, right? Never had that. Also, how are you doing? It's Eli, right? It's not Yuli. Mikey's been calling you Yuli on stream, and you didn't correct Mikey. It's it's Eli, right? I eat a lot of sugary stuff. I mean, a lot. Mikey doesn't take a lot of sugary stuff, honestly. I have no idea what this is called. Actually, not even in Chinese. Yeah, Mikey has no idea what it's called. What is it called? Where is it from? This brings back memories, the ones that cut your mouth were the worst, but also... The, what do you mean cut your mouth, though? What do you mean cut your mouth? Ice cream potong? Ice cream potong is like square, is it not? Ice... Potong. <laughs> Ice cream. There, this is like potong, right? Also, please don't make fun of the way Mikey's pronouncing it. This one. 
which are really good by the way if you guys have never had these you guys are missing out coconut flavor um the red bean one's really good as well yeah <laughs> six liters of fanna don't eat so much sugar killer you're gonna get like cavities and diabetes Uh, me, myself, pronounce E as you do. I'll pronounce you as you do. That's how English is like, so don't worry. All right. So, Marky, I'll just continue to call you Yuli then. It's it's a lot easier to say. You know, it's not really easy for, like, if, if you don't speak much Chinese, it's not easy to go, like, E. But, yeah. I prefer apple flavor or grape flavor of Fanta. Grape flavor of Fanta is the best. Try to change Marky's mind. You're gonna have trouble. No, wait, melon's the best. Mercury likes melon. Melon soda. In the Philippines, we call it Frosties? Frosties with a Y? We wouldn't call it Frosties here because here we've got um, cornflakes with like um, white sugar on them. And that's what we call Frost. Jesus Christ. Frosties. Phil. Ah! Fire! Thank you so much for the sapphire! Mikey boy! Hey, Fire, how you doing? Melon soda is amazing. Yeah! Oh, Fire, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for the sub. We were just talking about, like, snacks. Like, childhood snacks, you know? Fire, have you ever seen, like, this? Have you ever seen this thingy? Fire? Have you have you ever had this? Also, hi, uh, uh, Dreams Mapog. Welcome, welcome. Yee. Melon soda is amazing. It is amazing. Uh, in Japan, they have like melon soda with like like melon soda floats. So they put like vanilla ice cream inside the uh, melon soda. Ricky loves that. Gotta snap it in half and eat it. Exactly, Vooners. Also, welcome. How you doing? Yee, you snap it. You could snap it in half, but like. Mikey thinks like they're originally designed to actually be like snipped at the top and then like drunk maybe maybe because look at the shape like I've seen it before but I don't think I've eaten them uh you're not missing out fire it's nothing much it's just it's just syrup <laughs> what kind of childhood snacks did you have fire what kind of childhood snacks did you have like charcoal cuz cuz you're fire anyway there is also the jelly thingy you guys know it's like in the shape of a dolphin dolphin jelly thing that is not what Mikey expected to see dolphin jelly no this is was it was it a dolphin or was it was it a shark? Shark jelly. Mmm, this is not what Mikey was thinking of. <laughs> Charcoal chocos. I only really like galaxy chocolate. What is galaxy chocolate? Let Mikey search this up. Oh, this thingy! Okay, Mikey didn't have much chocolate as a kid. And when Mikey did have chocolate, it was usually just Kit Kats, maybe. Yee. You look like Haku from Spirited Away. Does Mikey? Uh, sort of, maybe, because of, like, the hair? But at the same time, no? Eh. <laughs> <laughs> Pink Dolphin. Pink Dolphin was the bomb. So there was this drink called Pink Dolphin. We had it in Singapore. Not sure where else we had it. That's an actual Pink Dolphin. Pink Dolphin drink. This thing! <laughs> it's like a peach flavored um, drink. And like... All the kids in school were buying it. Kit Kats are good too. They are. Ruru, hey Ruru, how you doing? Welcome, welcome. 
Hi, the soda rebel. Was I the only kid here that always attempted to eat the soda can? What the heck? What the heck? Also, hi, Chips. Where chess? Ricky wasn't sure if Ricky should start chess because Ricky wasn't sure if there were enough people to like play. But also, does Ricky actually look like Haku from Spirit of Away? Ricky can't remember much about Spirit of Away. It's been a while since Ricky watched it. Ricky's not a super huge Ghibli fan, to be to be frank. Although Ricky's Ricky, not Frank. But yeah, Pink Dolphin. Eee. Kit Kats are good. Have you guys had like the um, all the different flavors of Kit Kats? Like in Japan, they've got like lots of like different Kit Kat flavors. And they're all really good. Kit Kat. Japan. Ah, oh, look at look at the variety, guys. So Mikey's had like the uh like the macho ones before. And like the uh like the cheesecake and the strawberry uh cheesecake. Wanna try matcha Kit Kats? Fire! Should Ricky send some to ya? Maybe. Maybe. Matcha Kit Kat is the best. It's so good. It's so good. Ricky remembers a time because Ricky's family travels to uh, Japan like every year, right? Because Ricky's got like family there. So like um, uh, whenever Ricky went, Ricky would be like, so guys, um, you want Ricky to buy you guys anything? And then they'd be like, yes, Matcha Kit Kat, Matcha Kit Kat. And Ricky would have to buy like boxes of Matcha Kit Kat. Half of Ricky's luggage was like Matcha Kit Kat. And then like, like, um, the other half was Mikey's underwear. Don't tell them. Mikey's used underwear was just, like, pressed up against their, their matcha Kit Kats. <laughs> Mikey's not good at packing, all right? I've only had, like, two flavors of Kit Kat. What are they, Phoenix? What are they? Ba -ba -ba. Uh, thanks for the posture check, Chips. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, Ricky didn't see that. Ricky's, um... Ricky's, uh... Dumb butt. That makes it better, would you mean? <laughs> Fire, please. Ricky can send you his used underwear as well, if you want. Fire. <laughs> the only time I went to Japan, I bought two boxes. All for myself. Don't eat too much Kit Kat. You'll, you'll get really fat. Kit Kat, more like Kid Fat, right? <laughs> eh. Why? I named myself that because I like off brand soda. Ah, oh, what kind of off brand sodas? Name some, name some, name drop. I'm already really fat, might as well be happy. <laughs> true, true. Like, nothing wrong with being fat except for health issues. So do go for a jog every now and then, guys. Trying to watch that BMI, guys. But but yeah, nothing wrong with like being fat except for that. But be happy, guys. Be happy. Be happy. There was like a uh what flavor of Kit Kat was it? Ricky thought it was Oh, speaking of Japanese um snacks. Ruru, you still there, Ruru? Everyone knows this, right? <laughs> Everyone knows. <laughs> Everyone knows Tokyo Banana, right? Rude. Do Japanese people like not really even eat Tokyo Banana? It's like it's like a tourist thing, right? It's like a tourist thing, right? Tokyo Banana is yum, but probably overhyped. Ricky wouldn't say it's overhyped, though. It's really good. Ricky loves it. Ricky loves it. Regular and chocolate mint swirl. I'm incredibly basic. Chocolate mint swirl does sound really basic, Phoenix. Not gonna lie. <laughs> also, fire. Ricky does want to, like, send you stuff. If, if you're comfortable with it. If you're not... Then that's fine, but if you are, let Ricky know, like, where Ricky can send it to. Ricky wants to send you, like, care package, you know? It'll have a heart on it and everything. 
thank you for the host carlos thank you thank you never had those but it looks delightful so what it is basically it's a really really light sponge also Marky shouldn't have traced it like that that was that was weird it's like a really light sponge and inside of the sponge there's like banana custard and it's so good it's so light like if you guys know japanese desserts also thank you for the uh follow dark fana Thank you, thank you. Heck yeah, I'm down, Murky boy. Oh, okay, fire. Just DM Murky, you know. Murky will send you, like, a buttload of shit. Not, like, literally, but, you know, Murky will send you stuff. Including the underwear, if you want it. Hey. <laughs> oh, just kidding. Um, so, yeah, it's, like, a really nice custard inside and then on the outside it's like a really soft sponge it's so good it's banana-y it's really light it's good it's good only thing i want in my care packages are crepers wow wow <laughs> wow gotta monetize that underwear murky maybe speaking of which guys murky actually did like a painting recently Hold up, Ricky wants to pull it up. Let Ricky go to his Twitter. Um, Twitter. Oh, it won't be logged in, will it? It's not logged in. All right, Ricky will go look for a picture of it. Give Ricky a, a hot second. Eh, ba da ba da Okay, while Mikey searches for that, um, what other snacks are there that you guys have had? This video is not sponsored by Old Spice. <laughs> it's not, sadly. If Old Spice wants to sponsor Mikey, though, please. You know you're invisible when Mikey doesn't respond to like three to five of your messages no don't say that chips Mikey just isn't good at reading chat sorry about that uh hey yuto did Mikey already say hi to yuto Mikey did see you earlier yuto sorry if Mikey didn't say hi do you know jagariko let Mikey check with a c jagariko Oh, this thing is really good. This thing is really good. <laughs> Rude, this thing is really good. It's really good. Ricky loves this. Um, there's also that other one. Uh, uh, Rude, there's a, there's another Jaga... Jaga something. Jaga... Japanese snack. Jaga. This one! <laughs> is it the same thing? No, it's not the same. This thing, this thing's really good. Have you had this? Are you Ricky? Ricky's not Ricky. Why do people keep calling Ricky Ricky? Ricky's Marky. Yeah, these things are really good. They're really good. No, it's okay. Sorry, Yuto. Sorry, Ricky. Ricky give you a. Ricky give you a. Sorry, Yuto. How you doing though, Yuto? Yuto, you got any of these childhood snacks you want to share? Ricky's a popular boy to many chatters, please. Ricky's not. <laughs> but yeah, Ricky's not Ricky. Ricky's not Ricky. Ricky's Ricky. 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 It, it says so on Ricky's uh stream over there. It says Ricky the Evan channel. Ricky the only snack I want. <laughs> please, cliche. Smooth. That's the old school one. Oh, so this, this is the old school one? Is this the old school one? Or is... The other one, the old school one. Which one is it? Also, thanks for the hydrate chips. Thank you, thank you. Doing good, and I had like mi milk duds? What's milk duds? Milk duds. What the heck is this? Not gonna lie, you thought. Not gonna lie. Just looking at this, it looks 
No, again, Ranky says, no offense, you do. But it looks like rabbit poop. Does it not? <laughs> yes, I know it looks like poop. Is that why you ate it, you do? Is that why you ate it? Is... Is... Is that why? Also, what is that, Ruru? What is that? <laughs> is that why you... Honestly, though, have you guys seen... Have you guys seen Bear Grylls, like, squeeze the elephant's turd and drink the water that came out of it? Tell Mikey you guys have seen that. <laughs> like... Oops. Hold up. YouTube.com only. There we go. Um, um, Bear Grylls Elephant Dung. There we <laughs> It's so good. It's so good. You guys, you guys got, oh, Jesus Christ. You guys gotta watch this. It's really, really funny. Is it too loud? If you try to walk in the heat of the day with no water, you may last no more than four hours. But if it's a choice between life and death, there's a survival trick I was shown by an old ranger. One thing you can do if you're stuck out here with no water source at all is actually drink the fluid from a fresh elephant dung. Pretty <laughs> disgusting, but it could save your life. It's a real last resort. There can be harmful bacteria in that water. <laughs> it's so good. He picks it up and just squeezes it. <laughs> Did you guys see that chunk that like fell onto his face? <laughs> but if you have nothing else to drink, it could buy you extra time. <sighs> Not one of the better drinks I've ever had. <laughs> God, that's great. Honestly, that's really funny. <laughs> also, we're using private browsing because Mikey doesn't want to accidentally dox himself. Because Mikey's like logged in to like um to Google, you know, you know, Christian. Oh God, that. Oh, Mikey, Mikey's lightheaded after laughing so much. Oh. <laughs> Oh, what did I return to? Hey, Phoenix, you return to Bear Girls drinking water out of, like, elephant poop. It's really funny, though. It's really funny. <sighs> oh, God. Oh. Why don't you do that? Pretty sure Mikey's searches are full of poop. Wow. Wow, cliche. Wow. <laughs> Also, is this how Mikey wakes up in the morning? What do you mean, Crochet? What do you mean? Mikey really hit it after. No, Mikey didn't drink elephant poop. But it's really funny. Bear Girls does some stupid shit. Sometimes you should just accept death. Oh, God. It's really funny. It's... Uh, are you just going to be watching Bear Girls? Like, he can't think of anything else, though. There was that one time he wore, like, a seal as, like, a... <laughs> as an outfit. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see... It was really funny. It was really funny. <sighs> Get me out of here. Yuli, you can't stand the, the poop drinking. Well, it's not actually poop drinking, but it's, like... <laughs> when we go to Not Private, will we see Mikey's feet pics? Wow. 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 We don't talk about those. We don't talk about those. Oh, does he make more? <sighs> All right, well, while thinking of what we should do, let's just watch this video. <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, that's scary, Mikey. What the heck? What the heck? 
Oh, look at it, your puppies. <laughs> That's the face of a parent. That's the face of a parent right there. Are you watching videos? Yeah, because Ricky was showing everybody the um there was this video of Bear Grylls drinking water out of elephant poop. It's still one of Ricky's favorite videos today. It's really funny. Ricky's family size? No, Ricky's family is like five people. Ricky's got a mom and dad and two brothers. So that's that's it for Ricky's family. Oh, here it is. Ricky found the painting that Ricky did. Okay, so um Ricky did like a painting. Um, how does Ricky open this on the, uh... Ricky did, like, a painting, um, a while back. Like, a legit painting painting. Not a digital painting. Oops. Can we not... Okay. Ricky should just, like, copy this. Copy and paste. So, Ricky did this painting, like, a while back. Right now, it's just hanging above Ricky's house. Ricky's house. It's just hanging above Ricky's um um Ricky's computer. Ricky's thinking of selling it or like auctioning it. Would you guys be interested if Ricky were to do that? What do you guys think? Oh god, that's that's really hold up. This isn't the final piece. This isn't the hold up. Let Ricky get the final piece, which is on Ricky's uh. Uh, Ricky's Twitter. Let's see. Media. Let's scroll down. Should be able to find it soon. Ah, there it is. There it is. Ricky found it. Okay. Copy. And... Um... There it is. This is it. This is the final piece. So, like, um... Uh, do you guys think it's good? You guys think it's good? Hope you understand this, even though you only know English. Okay, Ricky will check that out, Shiki. In a bit. Looks like he'll make a good post-mortem piece. Wow. <laughs> wow. So, Ricky was thinking of auctioning it. Um, when Ricky does it, oh, that's not working. When Ricky does his like um re debut, Ricky might auction this away because it's currently taking up all of Ricky's wall space. He died as he lived, staring to the left. Wow, <laughs> but yeah, Ricky's thinking of auctioning it, and really, any price will do. Ricky kind of just wants to get rid of it because it's it's taking up so much space in Ricky's house, it's big. Like Ricky's, like Ricky's penis. Like, like Ricky's penis is really big. Like Ricky's penis. So like, even if someone just pays like five dollars for it, Ricky will just ship it over to whoever wants it. You know, it's how big is it? It's about it's fifty centimeters by twenty centimeters. If Ricky remembers right, no, that's not right. It's fifty. It's. How big was it? 50 by 30, maybe? Is it 50 by 30? No, 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 not Ricky's pee pee. The painting, the painting, not Ricky's pee pee. Also, hey, Milky, how you doing? Welcome, welcome to stream. How you doing? Hey. Chapata! Oh, my Milky! Welcome, welcome. How you doing, T? Oh yeah, let's watch Shiki's video. Can Ricky copy this link? Shiki, is it gonna be funny if Ricky doesn't understand what they're saying? Ricky hopes he finds it funny though. If not, Ricky will feel so bad for Shiki. Hi. 
。好。Grammarly can。Why is it actually called tapao though, Chiki, or or uh, Yuli? Explain to Ricky because like because um here in Singapore and like in Chinese in general, like when we say takeaway, it's like tapao, which is like um it's like beat bag, right? Or hit bag, right? Correct, Ricky. If he's wrong, because Ricky's probably wrong. But at the same time, the um, beat the food. What the heck? Hit it into a sack, homie. <laughs> Chinese is a funky language. The food is called pao. Pao te. Is that Papi Marky just chatting? Pog, hey Cream, welcome, welcome. It is. And Marky's drinking some whiskey. If you guys want to join Marky for a drink, do it, do it. Now's the time. I bet Marky's PP so big. If you lay it out on the keyboard, it could go from A to Z. <laughs> Please, Shiki. It could. You know how? It goes across the keyboard and it curls back. Try that. Or A to Z is like the girth, you know? It is a girthy boy. That's tiny? What you mean, Yuto, huh? Yuto, isn't yours the size of a key itself? Heh. <laughs> You're bent? No, Mikey can bend it if he wants. Ran out showed you unpog. Oh, that is like hit. So tapao will be hit the food. Yeah, Ricky knows it means like pack it up, but like, why do you say hit the food? Like, why? Then again, Chinese says a lot of things weird. Ricky knows this because like Ricky's always asking these kinds of questions. Also, Ricky wants to see him punch the 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 pow again. Any more videos, guys? Any more videos you guys want to watch together? We could, we could just do that. <laughs> you should get some help if your dick is curling. You should. You should. If it's a gentle curl, if it's a gentle curl, that's fine. If it goes more than... If it goes more than 45 degrees, Mikey would say, hit the... Go, go to the hospital. Get some help. Yeah. If that's how big it is when you can bend it. Exactly. Gonna go sleep, have a nice time auctioning children. Mikey's not auctioning children. But yeah, guys, if you guys wanna are interested in the painting, let Mikey know. Alright? He put his rage into that hit. It's really funny. It's really funny. <laughs> do you know Mark? Mark? Do you know Mark Angel comedy? No, Marky doesn't. Unfortunately, who is that? What is this, Wally? Marky wishes he. Oh, okay, Marky can copy the link. There we go. They but let's see what this is. Oops. They bugging, bro. Wow, bro, bro, bro. She made fucking beans. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> How do people make these kind of noises? Ah, oh, please, Ruru. <laughs> That's a honestly though, still Mikey's favorite. Still Mikey's favorite. Oh, oh, 
really sad because okay so for context this was the f oops boop the mic this was the first time ricky ever played um ever played like um minecraft right and like nobody um because uh devious sprite's the one who like convinced ricky to like try out minecraft and she was like all right you gotta go in and you gotta go in completely blind don't don't know anything about the game so like Ricky was really struggling, and that was the first ever creeper Ricky saw, and Ricky didn't know that creepers, like, blew up. So, like, so, like, when Ricky saw it, Ricky thought, like, oh, just run in, you know? We'd be safe. Ah! And then what it, the heck, it blew my up. House? Yeah. My... Huh? But yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's basically what happened. Also, Shiki pasted a link again. Ow. Oh God! <laughs> I'm dying. God damn it, Shiki! <laughs> fuck you, fuck. Looking look at title. looking at this though. Looking at it, Ricky's Ow. like. Koalas look really scary. Look at that. Look at that. It looks like an old man. It it literally looks like an old man. Also, is Mikey being a boomer for trying to zoom in on a video? Probably. It looks like an old man. Like, this looks like the hair. And like... Oh, God. Oh god. Let's see what other videos we got. Also, hi Project Kiko! Welcome, welcome! How you doing? Welcome, welcome! You guys got any videos to share? Do... Do share them. Just make sure you know they're TOS. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I need to sell me television. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is this? What the heck is this? Eh. Okay. <laughs> uh, Yuli, you want to give some context to what the clip is before we start? Eh? It looks so angry? Exactly! Did Marky tell you guys the story about, um... It's all in English? Okay, okay, great. So, like, uh, before we watch the video... So, Marky actually went to, like, um... Marky went to, uh... Australia. Marky went to Melbourne a while, uh, in 2016. So that was, like... Jesus Christ, that was five years ago. So, five years ago, Marky went to, like, um... To Melbourne, right? And Ricky drove, not Ricky, Ricky didn't drive. Ricky's dad drove us across the um, Great Ocean Road. And like along the way, there was a koala in the middle of the road. And like traffic just came to a complete halt because like, like um, the koala was just in the middle of the road. So like um, people started um, coming out of their cars to take a look. And like the koala was just chilling there. It was just like, it was kind of like lying on its side like Buddha, and then it was just like chilling there. And then, um, um, one guy like took his leg and like tried to like push the koala with his leg, and the koala just went crazy. The koala, all right, hold up, Ricky's gonna do his best koala impression. You guys, you guys ready? The koala, what the koala did was. The koala just went like. <laughs> he 
that's pretty much what the koala did. It it was quite something. It was it was terrifying. Its eyes were like open wide, and it was like. Ah! But yeah, it was it was. <laughs> you didn't need to highlight that, uh, cream. <laughs> hey, you came down here to Melbs. Ah, oh, nice Phoenix. You in Melbourne? Melbourne's a really nice place. Melbourne's a really nice place. There was a really good barbecue place, Mikey. You went to. You familiar with this place called um, Fancy Hanks, Phoenix? It's such a good barbecue place. It was really good. It was really good. Dawn's lazy ass. Exactly. It was just Dawn chilling in the middle of the road. Lurk by. I'm gonna go. I'm going for a race. Okay, Zavo. Have a good race. Hope you win. 10 out of 10 impression. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, let's watch the video, yo. I don't know what you're talking about. It's gummy bears. I swear. Gummy bears? Are you sure? Yes. Don't yeah. joke with me. I will eat this all. No. <laughs> no. No, your blood sugar. No. Your blood sugar. I have no blood sugar. But it's you're... stable. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's, it, you, I, okay, I told you what it is. Okay. okay, yeah. It is. See? See? Yeah, okay. Huh? You're telling a lie to me, huh? <laughs> I'm your mother. Okay. You want to share? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, this is great. This is great. That's really cute. That's really cute. You guys think it's staged? You guys think they stage it? <laughs> think I've heard of it? Yeah. It's it's really good. It's like near. Mercy remembers it's near the uh the theater place. Can't Victoria Theater theater or whatever it's called. <laughs> you want to share it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's it's cute. It's funny. That was great. Uh, okay, let's see. Um, Phoenix shared a video as well. Let's check it out. Hopefully, Marky didn't miss anyone's video, right? Next up should be Phoenix's. Oh, well, it's really quite funny. I was I was in bed sleeping at uh, 2 o'clock this morning. My wife comes in and says, oh, the shop's been, uh, someone ran into the shop. And I said, oh, what? So I jumped out of bed and all I had was my undies on. And I've walked out the front <laughs> and I've seen uh, the car smashed and I've seen the bloke walking back to the car. And so I've walked outside and I said, oh, what are you doing, mate? Like, you can't be leaving the scene. And he goes, don't be a hero, mate. And I said, I'm not trying to be a hero, but the police are coming. And he just decided he'd scoot up the road. And I just said, nah, it's not going on like that, mate. So I jumped in my car and I started chasing him up the road. And then he went down a side street and then the police were coming. And I flashed him and sent them off in the direction of him. But, mate, all I had was me jocks on. All, I was chasing him up the street and I'm just like, mate, like... Because you, cause you told me that this is your mate's shop yeah. and you didn't want him to get away. Yeah, no, nah, no. Nah, <laughs> well, his nice mate's mum's had this shop for like 40 odd years and uh, look at it. Is it bad it, that well, it's a mess? Isn't this it? kind of sounds mess, normal like, to Marky we're, now we're, because, we're like, explain here it is, mate. Look. Now, Daniel, you managed to. You guys know how, like, Marky's been, like, making fun of, like, um. Like, whenever, like, Marky's, like, with Dawn and chat and like in call and stuff, right? Mikey always like makes fun of him and like does like the really bad Aussie impression. Is it bad that because Mikey's done that so much, this kind of sounds normal to Mikey now? Is that weird? Like, so, uh, Mikey, like, Dawn and Mikey will get in call and Mikey will be like, hey, I do it. I do it, my. Do will ye? <laughs> Uh, is normal? Yeah, it's kind of normal now. It doesn't have to be funny video guys, videos, guys. If you guys want to show like uh, videos that might make Mikey cry, maybe like um, have you guys seen like those sad ads? Some places do really sad ads, and they're really sad. None of them have really gotten to Marky yet, though. If you, if anybody can show Marky like a touching ad that can make Marky cry, if you guys, if you guys manage to like make Marky tear today, Marky will do something special for you guys. Wait, have you seen Long Long Man? What's Long Long Man, Shiki? What's Long Long Man?
Also, let's see what um one shoddy gave us to watch. Oh, food! All right, we're jumping into the uh, the yum yums territory. We're jumping into yum yums. We know you love seeing some of the most mouth watering foods around the world. Can you imagine Dawn saying this? Exactly. Thanks for the hydrate, Viato. Burgers dipped in pools of gooey cheese and barbecue so tender it melts off the bone. Ah, uh, that looks really good. Goes on. <laughs> Fresh strawberries and homemade strawberry filling have made this donut a favorite for locals and tourists. Pro tip, eat it with a fork. Jesus Christ, that thing is loaded. The Cronut, a donut croissant hybrid. Lines are long and quantities limited. Okay, Marky's actually had a cronut before. They're good. This massive mozzarella ball is called the zizzone. Oh, it's got a nipple! This massive... Oh, look at that! Come on, this is a joke, right? The way that this guy's holding them? It's gotta be a joke. It's gotta be a joke. Oh, yeah, Marky, how many people did you need for chess? Not sure. If you guys want to switch over to chess, Marky's always open to doing it. So just let Marky know. Cancel culture, where are you? We need to exterminate this little girl called Marky. Marky's a guy. Cream, Marky. <laughs> Please. Thailand got the best sad ads. Yeah, Marky's seen some, but none of them made Marky cry yet. That cheese dipping burger is in Australia, by the way. What's so great about a cheese it's dipping burger, ball. though? It's called the Zitzona. Or a mother's breast in local dialect. Oh, okay, yeah, so it's actually mother's breast. Holy crap. Iberian chorizo comes from a special breed of pig called the black Iberian pig. Which okay, Ricky's had Asia this. Spain. Clay pot rice or both siphon. Oh, yes! Clay pot rice, rice guys! <laughs> Clay pot rice is so good, guys. Dish. It's known for fanjo, the delicious crispy layer of rice at the bottom of the clay pot. Pesto quattro formaggi or tomato sauce is stuffed into a pocket of Neapolitan pizza dough to make this over the top dish. This Egyptian street food staple looks like falafel, but it's actually made with fava beans, not chickpeas. Why is everything in this video like really stuffed? Maggie feels like the person who did this compilation really likes foods that are like, you know, inside of something. They love the turducken. Is that what it's called? Have you guys seen it? It's like a turkey with a duck shoved inside its butt. And the duck has a chicken shoved inside its butt. And Ricky's not sure if the chicken's got anything shoved inside its butt. Maybe? Maybe a quail or something? Nasi goreng, which means fried rice in Indonesian, is the country's national dish made with ketchup and an egg cooked sunny side up. Wait. You always hear people God saying, damn it. This year, I want to make more money. And then when you ask them... Tapioca crepes, or beiju, are a popular Brazilian snack. With Ooh! Similar to jelly. Rice and meat wrapped in lotus leaf and cuttlefish ink shrimp dumplings are a few of the reasons for the standard 45-minute wait. Ah, uh, dim sum is great. Maki feels like having dim sum now. Lots of fresh grilled veggies. Cheese I don't know, either that burger is freaking amazing or the cheese is freaking amazing. Probably the burger, right? Because the cheese is just cheese, right? Sandwich is a variation of the croque monsieur. Just add mortadella, sausage, and tomato sauce. The, uh, the presenter put their all into saying that. intensive dish takes four days to make. Free-range duck is stuffed with hoisin, soy sauce, and dry spices. This farm is what? one of only two that makes this artisanal raw milk aged chalva. And by the way, you'll need a boat to get there. Ricky loves Charles cheese. It. Former President Barack Obama was photographed eating it. From the rich gumbo to the shrimp clemenceau. It's a joke. Dookie chase and I know, I know you have a slong. I know, <laughs> I know you have a pee pee. I know you have ah, a meat steak. Classic yeah. British meal. Like At it does. Block, it's called the all in, meaning you can have it all. Oh, that looks really good. Limited gravy, all on one plate. You ate here, one shotty. You ate here or the previous one? It's like British meat. This one? Go to the shrimp clemenceau. This one? Dookie chase. Dookie chase. Is it this? Is it this? Yeah, it looks good. Ah, the classic British meal. I miss I eating dim sum. It's more like 
meaning you it's like more savory sushi in, in a sense because it's like bite size right my girl ate bone <laughs> trust it's safe for the past 100 all right he loves hummus right he loves hum guys guys like hummus like it sounds boring right who here loves hummus who loves hummus just a show of hands who loves hummus like you 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 tend to think like oh if something's like like if something's like simple like it probably doesn't taste good like you probably gotta do lots of shit to it well like hummus it's so good ricky loves it ricky loves it in fact simple is usually good hummus is just the guacamole of um what is it is it like middle eastern the garlic and tiny hummus is a must try it's made oh hummus hummus Mikey oh, wants some hummus. What does hummus taste like? So it's made from like chickpeas. So it's it tastes like it it tastes like chickpeas. <laughs> Guys, how would you describe the taste of hummus? It's sort of like it's almost nutty ish bean. It's like. It's like between bean and nut. And because there's like garlic in it, it's garlicky bean nut. <laughs> it's really good. Try it. Try hummus if you can. New Orleans is a gold mine yes, for no good food, Ricky. Ricky can imagine. Ricky's seen lots of like um it's the bakery's most New Orleans stuff. Not just because it's shaped like a reef. If it's just normal hummus with nothing, I would say this I would kinda say bland. Really? Humans, the brisket is carved tableside and served with bone marrow and Jewish deli-inspired garnishes. The Mediterranean is great. Yeah, it is. Spaghetti-like strips by hand. Um, he loves the soba. The they're made with gives them their signature nutty flavor. At Action Burger, you can choose to eat off the super what the heck? or villain menu. What the heck? Favorite ingredients combined with a dollop of Nutella on a Belgian waffle bun. So a while back, right? This is really a while back. It's like probably about more than eight years ago. Um, there was this place in Singapore. They started putting peanut butter inside burgers. They like started putting peanut butter inside burgers. And everyone was like, it's so good. You got to try it. And Ricky was like, okay. okay. Because Ricky's like, because Ricky's a chef, right? So like Ricky's like open to like trying stuff that people say is good. So like, so like when they said it was good, Ricky was like, okay, Ricky can sort of see that happening. You know, like why not? It's amazing. Have you guys eaten a burger with like peanut butter in it? If you haven't, do it. It's, it's so good. Peanut butter and burger is so good. Exact. See, yeah, guys, it's so good. It's so good. So like, um, Nutella is made out of like hazelnut, right? So like, why not? Makes this burger both superhero and villain. Pouring polenta straight onto wooden what the heck? An ancient Italian tradition. Really? Natura, but it's not just Any Italians here? Is that actually true? Bone marrow, meatballs, and marinara round out this family meal. Wait, it, it, is it Italian or is it like Spanish? Ricky, Ricky missed it. Oh yeah, I've seen burgers that have cheese on the inside. So when you eat the burger, essentially, oh, oh yeah, 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 that was really I popular like a while back. A must try it like it's made with smoked turkey. They put like the solid cheese <laughs> as they're making the patty, and then when they cook the patty, the cheese melts inside of it. Locals will tell you you haven't really been to Florence if you haven't eaten. Oh, that looks good. Garden. It's most popular sandwich, La Favolosa. Mikey loves ham. Pecorino, artichoke cream, and spicy eggplant. That thing's huge. It's ginormous. It's bigger than her face. Eddie's is reminiscent of a 1950s. Okay, Ricky's not big on ice cream. Ricky's not big on ice cream. Gotta say it. Gotta put it out there. Ricky's not big on ice cream. Oh, Jesus Christ. That scared Ricky. Po' boys are a staple of New Orleans cuisine. Eat them with fried shrimp. Oh, Ricky's heard of po' boys. Sandwich between two slices of crispy, fluffy French bread. It's just bread, right? 
It's just some really unhealthy bread. <laughs> what desserts do you like, Ricky? Ricky likes. Ricky's favorite desserts are these two. One, strawberry shortcake, which we're gonna watch a video on later. Let's. Have you guys seen like Japanese strawberry shortcake? They, they just do it different there. It's so good. The strawberry shortcake is life, guys. It's the best dessert on earth. Frankie's other favorite um, uh, dessert is the Mont Blanc. You guys know the Mont Blanc? This thing. This thing. Frankie loves the Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc is so good. We'll we'll watch a Mont Blanc video later. For now, let's finish this one. Twice monthly pop up in West Hollywood. It's because Hokkaido milk is so good. It's because they use fresh cream, like like they make their own fresh cream, and it's so light. It doesn't it doesn't taste you know. It doesn't taste fatty. It tastes so light, and that's why it's so good. three ingredients: avocado, grape sugar, and lemon juice. What the heck? Wait, what the heck? Can Ricky see that again? The vegan ice cream that went viral has only three ingredients. Avocado, grape sugar, That's pretty milk. cute. That's pretty cute, right? He's got, gotta admit, that's pretty cute. In Chelsea Market, an Israeli restaurant is jazzing up a relatively ordinary vegetable. The cauliflower. Have you guys ever done this to a cauliflower? It's really good. If you guys haven't, try it. D d do it, guys. If it's daytime for you right now, Take out a piece of paper, write on, write down on that paper. Shopping list, cauliflower. Make sure you try this. It's really good. Just like put like olive oil on the cauliflower and some salt and chuck the bad boy inside the oven at like probably like 190 or something that's in Celsius. Um, and then when it's like nice and charred like that, pull it out. It's really good. Like, Ricky thought, what? It's just a... It looks like it's just a um, a grilled cauliflower. It's really good. It's really good. But the official recipe is a secret, and for good reason. Besides grocery Sorry, my name's Team Strawberry Cheesecake. Cheesecake? Oh, did you... You guys like the Basque burnt cheesecakes, though? Have you guys seen those? Like the um Basque burnt cheesecake. Have you guys seen these? Tell me if you guys have seen these. They're so good. They're so good. These things are so good. Have you guys ever seen these? Let's before we continue. You guys gotta see this cheesecake. It's so good. No matter where like bass burnt cheesecake. And and Ricky's Ricky's uh, neighbor has recently started selling these. So they give them for free to Ricky and Ricky's family. So Ricky's been having this so much. It's so good. Just look at it. It's what it is basically. It's like a really runny and almost. It's almost like an undercooked cheesecake. So it's like sort of like goopy in the middle and on the outside it's got like this burnt crust is so good also hi nunya how you doing welcome welcome to Ricky's stream hope you're doing well okay we can like bring up the speed how do we bring up the speed sounds so yummy it's really good you guys gotta you guys got to try it. If you haven't already tried it, try it. So it's like... So it's like cream cheese, right? Oh, Jesus Christ. It's still really fast. Oh, no. Wait. This is normal. I can bring the volume down a bit so you guys can hear Mikey. Mikey does a cooking stream when? Mikey's planning to do one, but for now, Mikey doesn't have the uh, logistics of doing so. Mikey's probably got to get it like a GoPro or something, you know? So that Mikey can put the camera on top of his head. Bro, I add strawberry to this or something tart and you got yourself a nut worthy dessert. Exactly. Look at that. It looks so smooth. Did you see that? Look at that. Oh. Oh, 
my look at that guys look at how smooth that looks it's like a baby's butt Can you believe it it's... oh yeah Oh, that's great. That's great. Mikey's thighs? <laughs> okay, yeah. Mikey's thighs pretty smooth, though. No hair on them, you know? You guys gotta see, like... Oh, no! Spoilers! So, it's, like, really runny. And then, like, you just pour it into the mold. And then... You gotta knock it to like get the air out of the um. The min oh, look at the jiggles! Look at the jiggles! Oh, it's jiggling! Oh, look at the jiggles, guys! Look at the jiggles! Oh. I'm an avid enjoyer of jiggles. Exactly. Cakes, thighs, boobies, whatever. Oh, oh look at that. We don't have to watch him eat it. Damn. From my food truck in the parking lot. There's no hair on Ricky except his head. It's all smooth. Exactly. It's that's that's actually true. Jesus like Christ. Opt for the three bite version. <laughs> Sunday or Korean blood sausage is made with a waste nothing mentality. Do you guys like blood sausage? Have you guys ever had blood sausage? This classic Korean street food. It's pretty good. Ricky kind of likes it. He Sorry, I wet my pants. <laughs> a big part of Vietnamese now culture, which encourages communal eating. These freshwater snails, lemongrass, chili peppers, and lime leaves to add flavor. The dosas at Temple Canteen are made from rice flour and lentils and are filled with vegetarian ingredients. This is really good. This is really. Have you guys ever had this? Comes from its location in the basement of a temple. Like dosai, we guys. Yeah, it's a 14-year-old boy that doesn't have pubes. Kinda sus. It happens. It happens, Cream. It happens. It happens. This mango dessert is meant to be eaten with Whoa! the skin on. It's the tangy mix of a tamarind and Whoa! chicken chamoy sauce made from chili, lime, and pickled fruits. Gas station snacks are elevated at Garibaldi, a restaurant located at a Conoco gas station. Oh! Cactus plays an important role in these southern Mexican dishes, like the meat and avocado heavy huarache azteca. Fried peanuts? Oh, Mikey knows this. This is good. <laughs> for a flavor packed national dish. It comes in a signature rooster bowl imported directly from Malaysia. The Tokyo location of this restaurant was the first ramen restaurant in the world to win a Michelin star. The winning dish features perfectly timed eggs, soy sauce aged for two years, and truffle oil. He just brag about being hairless, so basically he's saying he doesn't need to Baker's shave. <laughs> Mikey doesn't need to shave that much. Flavors, like peanut butter and jelly and Nutella sea salt. Is your mouth watering yet? Ooh! This tender lamb dish is seasoned with spices imported from Pakistan. It's served with rice or yummy bread called malawa. Also, Marky, have you heard of Little Texas? What's Little Texas? What's Little Texas? Is this a... Is... Is it like a sex thing? <laughs> A 
a Texas themed bar in Tokyo. Okay, so what's so great about it? Like, what's what's so special about it? Sorry, not great. What's Little Texas? Wait, what is it? What is it? You guys make it sound like it's like the biggest thing ever. Alright, so we're gonna watch the Mont Blanc, right? Let's watch the Mont Blanc. Um, Who can take a sunrise? Sprinkle it in to you. Thank you, Apple. It's not the biggest thing, but it's kind of big. The novelty of it. It's an American themed bar in Japan. Should Mikey actually search this up? Does Mikey want to search it up? What's it called again? Little Texas? In Tokyo, right? This thing? Why? Why does Mikey need to know this? <laughs> anyway, Mont Blanc. Uh. The lack of music is kind of throwing Mikey off. <laughs> It's like ASMR. Listen to that whisking. You like the whisking. You like the whisking, don't ya? You like it. Oh, look at those stiff peaks. Also, before we watch this, Shiki did post something, so Mikey, before Mikey forgets, let's watch the thing that Shiki posted. Because Mikey would- Oh, it's a sad one! It's a sad one, Shiki! If you're still there, we're gonna watch your video. Oh no! This is why health- This is why, um... Make sure you got medical insurance, guys. Hospitalization, you know?
Shiki might have to try a little harder. Miss the other one? Hold on, Ricky, let's check it out. Which one is it, Shiki? Did you. Is it this one? Is it Long Long Man? <laughs> is that the one? Okay, okay, okay. We'll watch that now. <laughs> what is it, Jiki? What is it? What is it? What is Kinda want to try that. <laughs> These are so <laughs> strange. <laughs> it's the same guy. It reminds Ricky of that. Was it like a bear or something? The panda. The panda that would like beat the shit out of everything. Have you guys seen those? <laughs> oh, jeez, I got a key change for it. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh. Dog, uh, why? あの、それ触ってみてもいいですか。どうぞ。長い。これ。あ、よ。すいません。あ。あ、よ。The music is the best part. Thank you for the follow art team. Thank you. Thank you. ちょっと寝込んでて。これ持ってきたから一緒に食べよう。今日は。ちょっと待って、今は飲め。ラン。あ、いや。あいつが来てたんだ。あいつが来てたんだ。あいつが来てたんだ。あいつが来てたんだ
おやすみおやすみ食べるとおしめくださいラン<laughs> Who thought of these ads? It's him again! Ricky missed him! Huh? Oh. Sakeru Gumi, Nagai Sakeru Gumi. Saken Janezo, Hatabo, yo! <laughs> Jesus Christ, that is pretty long. Oh man! Ricky already knows where this is going. She keeps. She keep, Ricky already knows. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Um, what? Henry Zimanoff? He wants to try this now. Can somebody send some to Ricky? Jesus Christ, Cream, are you actually? <laughs> Thanks for sending that to Ricky Shiki. That was really entertaining. That was really funny. Oh god. <laughs> to be honest, that was karma. It was you though. They like wow. Mm-mm. She deserved it, right? Hold on, I sent a vid, but it got buried. I can't look for it. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Okay, let's see. Where is it? Oh, Ricky doesn't see it, one shotty. Ricky doesn't see it. Exactly, Yuto. Are you into that kind of thing, Yuto? Also, morning, Ricky. I haven't slept. Yuto, get some sleep. What time? Isn't it like 11 a.m. for you already? Root commercial aside, the gum is actually really good. Oh, Ricky's never tried it. Ricky wants it. Oh, we've already watched that one. One shotty. We've watched it. 8 a.m. Same. Oh, oh, same time as Wyatt. Okay, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Long, long, man. <laughs> Oh, Ricky wants to try it. You know an ad is good, like, when it makes you want to try it. Did you guys see the, um, the one with the panda? But, bro, <laughs> no, I'm not into cooking, bro. Okay, okay. Okay, you told. If you say so. If you say so. Oh, wait, we were watching the Mont Blanc. Let's go to like the construction of the. Ooh. Would you call these things again? Like they're made of um, they're made of egg whites. What are they called again? What are these things called again? I keep forgot what they're called, completely. 
macaroon no the the macaroons like when like you put them together with like the um the stuff in the middle but like otherwise there's a name for it what what's it called again meringue meringue it's meringue it's meringue meringue that's right, Marine. Who can take a sunrise? Who can take a sunrise? Sprinkle it with dew. Sprinkle it with dew. Cover it in chocolate and a miracle or two. The Candyman. Hey, Lady Octopus, how you doing? Good morning to you. We're just watching some videos. If you got any videos you want to share, do let do share them with hit the chat. Oh, Shiki, is that another? That's the one, the panda. We'll watch that after this. Have you guys seen the panda one? I had a video of mine, but I can't remember because I was distracted by the long gum. Long! <laughs> okay, let's skip ahead a little. Oh, satisfying. 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 Look at, look at, yeah, it's satisfying. So you make like little discs with um Let's see. Oh here are the chestnuts. Oh it's a paste. Why didn't they use like fresh chestnuts? Have you guys seen fresh chestnuts? They're like they look like sea urchins. And then inside of the, um... Oh, that's the chestnut. What was the other thing then? Ooh. That looks pretty good. They look like sea urchins. And then inside of the sea urchin, you get like the chestnuts. It's pretty strange. Is that butter? Oh! That sound. Oh, yeah. Anybody else, like, really like food noises? Oh! This one... This one sounds pretty lewd, not gonna lie. Um... <laughs> like, like, guys, if we, like, just, like, turn off the, uh, the video... If we just turn off the video, and, like... Okay, 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 okay. It's, it's, it kind of sounds normal now. <laughs> I was like, I was like, wow, what are we watching? <laughs> Burn it. Ricky wants to see fire. Ba ba boom! Where's the fire? Ba ba boom! Fire! If you ever want to do like flambéing and you want the fire to be like really visible, do it at night or in the dark, you know. Oh, we can see it though. We can see the fire. Sounded like taking a piss, not gonna lie. This video this is why you put music in videos. So what is that? Is that like a glue? And then the meringue?
It is much better, isn't it? Don't have to listen to food sex. Oh, look at that! It's like a snowball! Oh, that one looks like a boo. Oh, they look so perfect, though. Why? Oh, you gotta make them into, like, that cone shape, you know? Also, Marky forgot to drink his whiskey, and now it's, like, oxidized. Oh, yeah, Marky loves Mont Blancs. <laughs> Actually, there's this place in New, or New Orleans called Brennan's. It's where they originated the Bananas Foster, and you gotta dress formally to get into the restaurant? Oh, really? What's a Bananas Foster? What is that? Also, Mikey can't hear Brennan without thinking of Brennan Fraser. Oh... Uh... Damn, that looks good. It's like... Oh! It looks magnificent. Magnificent. pretty and now Marky's hungry I'm going to do homework see you Marky stay safe and enjoy the stream thanks for dropping by Nunya good luck with the homework in fact Marky's probably gonna end stream as well because uh, it's pretty late Marky wants to get some rest but yeah foster is two cooked bananas with rum sauce and ice cream. They actually set the rum on fire when they're putting it on the bananas. Bananas. Foster. This one? Oh, is this the one? It's Brennan's. This is the place you're talking about. Sounds like butter, right? This dish was created in 1951. Um, named for Mr. Richard Foster. He was a good friend of our owner, Owen Brennan. A regular in the restaurant, local businessman. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, and our owner, Owen, challenged... Look at all that butter. To Ooh. ...create a recipe featuring bananas, a dessert. Oh, that looks really good. Banana has got to be like one of the like best tasting fruit. Change Mikey's mind. Ooh, look at that. Banana is a really good and versatile fruit. Yeah, it's really good. <clears throat> There's the bananas. Ba -ba -boom. Back down in the Hurry up, fire. Yeah, you gotta be wearing suits and dresses. She's not she's not in a dress. But yeah, Ricky gets it, so it's like uh there's a dress code then. My brother did a genealogy. 
That looks really good. Is it just like... Is it just like an upscale um, banana split then? Ooh, that looks good. All that butter. Butter and brown sugar. Can't go wrong with that. It looks really sweet though. But all that liquor should probably bring down the sweetness. There's still some in the pan. Lick it up. Lick. Lick it up. Anyway, this will probably be where Ricky ends off for today. Let's go look for someone to raid. In the meantime... Thank you everyone for joining Ricky for today's stream. Uh, we will be raid... Let's see. The panda vi Oh, god damn it. We didn't watch the panda video. We'll watch the panda video in the next stream. But Ricky's really got to go now. So... Sorry about that. But the... Yeah, we'll watch the so panda... Oh, Jesus Christ. It's Ricky. We'll watch the panda video in the next stream. For now, let's go look for someone to raid. Anybody got any suggestions? Let's raid someone who's, you know... Hmm... Thanks for streaming chess. Sorry we didn't get to play chess, guys. Ricky will arrange for chess one of these days. If you guys really want to play with Ricky that badly. But, um... For now, let's go find someone to raid. Let's see, who who's on? Shiki, got any, um... I'll join for that chess stream? Really sorry, guys. For those of you who came for, like, chess. <laughs> Let's see. Maybe rate Mark yet. Wow. Wow. Thanks for stream. No worries, guys. No worries. Just glad you guys could join Ricky, you know? It was fun. It was fun just like watching videos and shit. Came here for Ricky, chess or not. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Minimal I who partner celebration. Uh, I know a homie had him raid you a bit back. His username is Tyor... Tyor... Rise? Tyrees? Ricky can't really remember. Sorry about that. Minimal... Waifu. Well, since you're doing a partner celebration... We could... We could give him the, um... Ray Ricky trusts um, Shiki's uh, recommendations anyway. Not like Ricky doesn't trust anyone else, you know. But like, since um, since it's a special occasion thingy, let's go for the uh, <laughs> let's go raid minimal waifu. The raid, bam. <clears throat> um, raid message will be congrats on. Partner raid. Ricky will appreciate if you guys can um can uh, join in on the raid and um if you guys wanna if you guys don't have Ricky's emote, you guys can actually unlock Ricky's emote with like uh, channel points now. Yeah, so no excuse to not participate, guys. Let's see those raid messages, guys. Um. Do go support them. They're playing Jackbox right now, so that's fun. Uh, and they're Filipino, so support, guys. Support, support. Support, like... Like, scaffolding supports a building that's being built. The scaffolding doesn't actually support the building, does it? But anyway, thank you, everyone. Do remember to follow Mikey on Twitter um, and join Mikey's Discord. It's the best place to interact with Mikey outside of streams. 
um, Twitter is the best place for um, Mikey's uh, updates on streams when they're happening and what will be happening. If not, Mikey, I'll see you guys in Mikey's um, next stream. Bye-bye!